What is up guys, Sushi Mancer here. In this video, I want to be covering a spoiler that was released today on Mythic Spoiler. And that card is Omnath, the Locus of Rage. I'm not that particularly clued up on the lore, from what, but from what I know, Phyrexia has infiltrated and um, has corrupted planes. And one of them uh, corrupted Omnath. I think this series is basically like a mashup of a lot of legendary creatures either working together or um, this is like a mashup of two heroes. And in this video, um, Omnath Locus of All was spoiled. So Omnath of Locus of All is a 5 mana or Phyrexian Black 4-4 four, four Phyrexian Elemental that reads if you would lose unspent mana, that mana becomes black instead. And it reads at the beginning of your pre-combat main phase, look at the top card of your library. You may reveal that card if it has three or more colored mana symbols in its mana cost. If you do, add three mana in any combination of its colors and put it into your hand. You don't lose, you, if, you, if you don't reveal, put it in your hand. So just to start this off, um, the, the first thing that I came to mind was three mana, uh, um, yeah, three mana tribal. Um, you basically run all the charms that cost three mana. You reveal that charm and then you put it in your hand and then you cast it for its uh, converted mana cost because you add mana in any combination to your mana pool. So not only does this color fix, let's say you don't have all the lands, but you have Omnath out, um, it helps you color fix so you can cast any charm that you draw. Um, you can brainstorm, put stuff on top and then reveal and add mana to your mana pool. Um, it's it says three or more so it can be for example a form uh, com uh four converted mana cost card you add three mana you use one mana to pay for the generic cost and then you can cast that spell for free so in this deck and i don't think this is going to be a budget commander i think this is he's going to receive a lot of attention in the set if he's not and i'm wrong i'll definitely make a deck deck around him using charms and um, four mana or three mana converted mana cost spells to just generate value and hopefully flood the board or have a lot of interaction. But something to also note is that if you would lose unspent mana, that make, um, that mana becomes black. So which means that um, if you, let's say you tap all your lands for five mana, you the, the turn ends and you lose mana, it instead becomes black mana. Same with uh with what other I think it Omnath Locus of Mana. It had the same um effect. You would you wouldn't lose mana as phases and steps end, and then Omnath will get faster passer for each green mana. But in this, it's basically black mana, and then um you can use that mana to cast let's say a, a like a very very large let's say um uh what is it. Get into the abyss you can cast any x mana cost spell it is a bit slow but i think you will be using a lot of mana you um through uh, you'll use a lot of mana that you generate through his ability and i think this is a great value generating commander you will most likely play this on turn four i think anyone playing commander will know that paying two mana for a commander cost um put two life for a com commander cost isn't that significant because you start with 40 life or in a 1v1 you start with 25 life i think but yeah that's it for this video and i hope you guys enjoy i hope this deck up um, omnath looks of all becomes budget but i strongly doubt it i think every omnath has been doing good in whatever set it was printed but yeah guys enjoy